Welcome, welcome, welcome to Movie Trailer Talks. Welcome to Movie Trailer Talks. If you love horror movie, then this movie in particular is for you. It is called The Winnie Pooh, Blood and Honey. So these two lovers went to their former home, guys, and the boy has like take uh, his girlfriend to meet his parents in which he has loved abandoned and because he wants a reunion with the family he has to go with his one true love to show the parents that he's ready to be a man once more but he missed everything about the parents guys the parents went psych and they went so bloody because their only son left them and they couldn't hold it any longer but become psychos and chaos guys so this boy went and the first thing that happened was the girl got killed and the boy was trapped in the house so a few friends went along looking for these two guys and they came across the same building guys and they were like chilling having fun feeling at home but they never knew that death is in, in the building so the two couples started killing these things guys and all they do is to try to survive and the boy was like shouting why are they taking lives and why are they killing so it all ended in tears but it's a nice cool movie that i would love you to go and check out and i would like you to share subscribe and please click on the notification button to see more latest updates of movie trailer talks and you will select the kind of movie you want to watch right here from this channel see you next time in our next video and we will be happy that you did please be with you Welcome guys, welcome guys, welcome to this channel, welcome to Movie Trailer Talks and today we're going to be talking about a nice cool movie guys, thank you to those who have been subscribing, thank you to those who have been sharing and thank you to those who have been liking okay today we're going to be talking about a nice cool movie, it's called Triangle of Sadness at first when I saw this trailer talk, uh, the name of this movie, I was astonished like I was trying to know uh, where this movie is going to like the playtime or uh, the storyline so but this movie is a cool movie and if you love sea movies or titanic and you want to have a glimpse of it i think this movie is for you so triangle of sadness uh it's all about uh these people going for excursion and they have to go through the sea using the titanic mind you when to talk about titanic you know what it is okay now we have thousands of people on this lifeboat and at the, it is going we have different kind of people that is going for this trip for a different purpose we have couples there we have uh young lovers we have uh commanders we have travelers and many other people who are in this life boat or this titanic guys and it turned out to be that the captain of the ship and the soldiers there they are all evil demons and since their purpose is to make human pay with their lives they have to like use this titanic as an avenue to get a lot of people to lose their life so uh they go to a triangle in the middle of the sea and it is called the dead sea so at that point they have no choice but to find a way to survive so this is a nice cool movie i would like you to check out and i would love you to like and subscribe for more info thank you for watching peace be with you welcome guys welcome to this channel thank you to those who have been liking sharing and subscribing today we're going to be talking about the house of dragon so this sequel was drawn out from the game of thrones and if you have watched game of thrones you know that the movie of this kind of nature is so so welcoming guys so so entertaining and so so loving so guys uh the house of targaryens just as we have seen in the game of thrones they draw out from the broad uh 
the dragon bloodline guys so and um, you know the house of targaryens they control dragon and this is what they did in game of thrones but this time the house of dragon is giving a few picture of the targaryens guys so and they took us 1700 years back how the targaryen bloodline started the successors and every other thing and this is what this movie is all about who will sit on the iron throne so the iron throne provides a lot of power and he who controls the iron throne controls the five kingdoms guys so and we have seen that Jon snow was part of uh the targaryens in the game of thrones so this is how uh the house of dragon is being presented this story so they go back in time to bring us the real history of the targaryens before it's appear even in the game of thrones guys so before the mad king just like we know in the game of thrones so this is a nice cool movie i would love you to go and watch because it is full of history it is full of a lot of drama because it is all about the success so at the starting of this movie the king had to give up the throne to his brother and not to his daughter so now uh the daughter couldn't become king because it is not according to uh the targaryen's law not as if it is in the law but uh politically wise they cannot do this so guys then he become the king now it is now for him to look for his own successor to replace him after his death as king and that is how the whole drama came up so i'm going to say a lot in the house of dragon episode one is out in net ninja and i would love you to go and check it out if you love the game of thrones and want to know more about it so thank you for watching thank you for subscribing thank you for those who have been recommending this channel i'm so grateful that you did Peace be with you. See you next time in our next video. Welcome guys, welcome guys, we're going to be talking about a very nice movie. Thanks to those who have been subscribing to Advanced TV, thanks to those who have been liking, we really appreciate it. We're going to be talking about a nice movie, it's called 3000 Years of Longing. So 3000 Years of Longing is more like Aladdin. So but it's a different kind of storyline, it's a different kind of touch that you will love to listen or watch guys. So this mom was so lonely, she was without help, nobody to play with her since her husband died and she has never found love so she went to a museum and to take a view at the gallery there and she was watching this auto fast guys it happened that a mystical man came out of it and uh, asked, him, asked her to make a wish and she decided not to make a wish at the beginning but trying to know how or why it came to be so the man took him and this man requested is Idris Alba he took her to the beginning of the whole story, how the whole power and how the whole story about uh, him and the ghetto came to be. And after the human view everything, which is in this story, there's a lot of there's a lot of passion, there are a lot of things that have happened in the past that you will love to see in this movie because that is what really made of this movie. At first she realized that the Idris Abba is actually an evil man and with him controlling these wishes, then the world will be in chaos. So she has to fight for her own self, for her survivor and survivor of the whole world. Because at this point, the fate of the world is in her hands. Guys, it is something that you would love to watch. It is something that you would love to check out. And we will tell you more about this movie when it comes out. Thank you for watching. I'm pleased to be with you.